See, everybody likes a champion, but everybody doesn't want to do what it takes to get there. So we're here to say that we love you, each and every one of you. And we're here to support you, not only today, but we were here yesterday. Welcome back to another episode of the Lightwork Experience. It's been 80 years since the Homer Pelicans won a state championship. Back then, times were different. And so this town really needed a healing. This football team doesn't even realize what they did with bringing home a championship to Homertown, USA. Big win for the Pelicans. Of course, you know, we had to pull up on the parade. It got rained out, but they took it in the gym. Ms. Harry, we got this. We got this. Cool, calm, and collected, always with a smile on their face. They were confident. I said, don't get overconfident. I said, because that's when they'll get you. Miss Harry, we got this. So we've been on it. We work for it. That's all we want. And when we were growing up, Pam P, we've been on the championship. So we got it, especially, very special. For you seniors, we thank you. We thank you from your junior high, from your peewee. We thank you. And job well done. To you freshers, this is where you can go. To you junior high, don't skip your summers. Put the work in, and we want you to graduate. Just work hard, never give up. If you don't play while you're young, your time will come. I had to wait my time too. I mean, it, it feels good, man. Like, we come, like being a senior, leaving with a uh, ring, looking at everybody coming together, man, it feels good. Hey, big for the program, big for home. Man, we just needed something. We needed something positive like this, man. Just shed light on the time, man. Like, telling how we've been here, man, we just, we got the right people in position, man. People that know our kid, love our kid, got faith in our kid, man. To your coach, oh my God. To your coach, hum humility again. We appreciate you for the man that you are, the humility that you show, the leadership that you give, all in, off the field, everywhere you go. To his mother, Kathy Casey, wherever you are. I just want to say thank you to God because without him, you no know, none of this is possible. And uh, I know I got coach over here, but that don't happen without these kids I got, man. He's got way too kids, man. I tell you the hardest one of the kids I ever had. Y'all ever come to a practice, y'all see what we're talking about. We knew from day one what we had. We went down uh, to state, you know what I'm saying, playing on bringing the back and we knew we had. And uh, now we coach over here with all my coaches also, man. Great coaches, hard work, man. They put the work in in the summer, just like these boys did. I want to say thank you to everybody that came out, man. Everybody that showed support to us all year. Uh, keep it going, because they ain't going to stop right here. Yeah. Man, they, they some good role models, man. Like. All of us came in together, like my freshman year, where they fresh, they uh, first year, so you know we kind of grew, like grew with each other. So any problem we hit them up, you know they will lead us the right way. Yeah. They start from we be all self with them. We keep everything real since day one, and they relate to us more like that. Then like I'm on 28, they 16, 15, 18, so it's not a big age gap. So what they going through, I just went through it. What they doing, I've already done it. And, and they come talk to me, and I just keep it real with them. And so they build a relationship on the field and off, so they get them to do anything you ask them to do. And slowly they kind of chipped away and they kind of ragtag pulled it together. I mean, fans wouldn't come. When they started losing, they would leave. You had that core group, like I said, that have been along for the ride. But for those, to others, it happened overnight. But this has been all the way for some of us since Pee Wee. And they've been working, but they got a synergy when they got to the high school under Coach Casey. And he got these guys to where the seniors finished strong, the seniors finished hard. You have MVPs, some of them are going to the next level in sports. But either way, they're all gonna be great men in life through this experience. And we thank them. We salute them, and that's why we're here today. Oh! Oh! Oh, hold on! Oh, 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 oh.
I'm from nowhere I'm from. Be real big for the town and the community, man. For black and white, everybody, old and young. Like I say, it's been 80 years since this happened. And now you have this coaching staff, young coaching staff, that a lot of people were saying we have enough experience to do it. And now we went to quarterfinal first year, semifinal second year, and just won a championship third year. So somebody knows something, it's a big blessing. And to be a part of it, words can't explain it. And knowing one day, 50 years down the road, if we all still alive, we're gonna look and be in the history book saying we brought the ring home to Homer. This championship is not only for Homer, it's for Cleveland Parish in general. For Athens, Summerfield, Lisbon, and Haynesville. But we will be back again. And I told you I'm gonna bring that hard way home. If next person meet me in the Superdome, I'm gonna bring it home again. Cause I'm a Pelican and I know we ready. It's all love, man. Home fighting Pelican, man. State champion. If we come to Claymore, you better be ready as yeah.